Hello! Welcome to another plan with me. Um, this one's a little bit different. I normally plan in the standard Erin Condren, vertical, neutral. Um, but today I am using the Recollections Spiral Planner. It's very similar to the Erin Condren, um, but it's much cheaper. <laughs> um, which I didn't pay full price for my Erin Condren. I got it um, on sale. So I try not to pay. Well, I've, I've yet, I have several planners. Let me back up. I have many, many planners, none of which I have paid full price for. So that's how I justify it. Anyway, um, so yeah, I got the vertical from Recollections. They don't offer a neutral um, style. So, you know, whatever. That's fine. Um, yeah, so I wanted to do a plan with me in this one since it starts this week. Um, so let me just back up for a second. <laughs> this is not how they normally look. I'm sure you're very aware. Oh, gosh. I'm sure you're like very aware of <laughs> what these planners look like. Um, this is normally what it looks like. However, there's not these side lines to kind of butt your stickers up against. So I kind of drew in my own. Some of them, I'm not gonna lie, are a little janky, um, which that one's on the inside, so it doesn't really matter. That probably won't show. But yeah, I just took a mechanical pencil and a ruler. I used a little quilting ruler because it's got these, I would use an acrylic see-through ruler, ruler so that you can, you know, make sure. Because I use these lines to somewhat make sure my my ruler was straight. But towards the end of the week, I got a little bit in a hurry. So they're not perfect, um, and it is a little time-consuming. Um, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to put my stickers down and then hopefully come back over it and erase it. That's my plan anyway. I've not done a dry run yet, so <laughs> fingers crossed um, that this works. Okay, I got trash over here. So, yeah, I'm not quite sure how I want to do this. I'm usually a no white space planner. I've been trying, trying in theory, yet to succeed in trying white space. And I don't think I'm going to try now. I think I'm going to try just to do my standard um, fair. So this is what I, the kit I'm going to use. This is one that I got in a grab bag. It's not really a color palette that I care for. So <laughs> I'm going to use it in this planner. I'm going to do kind of a mock plan with me. Um, but I'll go through it really quick so you can see it. And then these are the little sheets, the deco, I guess, and the... Um, little things labels okay so I don't have date covers let me start let me start over that's not even what I usually start with okay so she has these really skinny little washi strips um, that I don't think are going to cover all of the lines I'm not I'm gonna preface this by saying I'm not a fan of glossy and this is glossy. Ugh, I'm trying to get better. So yeah, this doesn't quite go all the way. Hmm. All right, give me just a second. Maybe I have a regular washi maybe that works. Maybe not at all. Let's try this one that's a little, I think that one, I think that one works okay, maybe. Whew. Let's try, okay, let me get all this out of the way here, hang on. All right, so first, first I'm gonna stick these down, actually. I'm going to put this, whoops, I'm, I'm going back and forth here, y'all excuse me. 
figure out where this goes, or I'm sorry, not goes, where this starts, just so I can kind of gauge. Okay, line these up with the bottom row. And these, of course, are meant to fit, or whatever, size to fit the Erin Condren. They don't cover the Erin Condren lines, obviously, but um, the diamond, oh gosh, it's really, it's not really late. It's just been a really long day. <laughs> um, but the dimensions with this planner are pretty similar. So, the uh, Erin Condren stickers. Our stickers meant to fit the Erin Condren should fit this. Um, there was something else I was going to say, and I've just totally, <sighs> totally blanked out. Oh, when I used one of her kits in my regular planner, what I did was I scooted this down, and then I did labels down here with, she has little dinner time icons. And now that I'm thinking about it, that may still be what I do here. Because <laughs> this is pretty transparent washi. And I'm not sure if I'm honestly going to be a fan. I'm still not really sure if this pink matches. Move that before I knock it over. Um, I'm going to put it down. That's the great thing about washi tape is you can pull it back up if you don't like it. Yeah, I can still see that line under there, which really bothers me. And I have white out, but it's in the kitchen for some reason and I don't want to go get it. I'm just going to go with it. Oh, that'll be fine. Okay, where is... I got one of these uh, Monday earlier this week. Um, at Michael's, so I'm really excited. <laughs> I'm gonna actually use it because I bought it and I was like, I never need a, a night, like, I never need to cut anything, and now here we are needing to cut something. And I'm like really afraid I'm gonna just cut through the page because I see that happens, so I'm <laughs> gonna do it very delicately. Okay. And I'm gonna do the same over here. Ooh, maybe if it cooperates. There we go. Okay. If this weren't kind of like a mock spread, I would totally go get that white out to mark out that white or that black line, but. I'm gonna, I'm not gonna let it bother me, even though I've mentioned it, you know, umpteen times now. <laughs> okay, so there is the bottom covered. Okay, so this kit doesn't come with date covers. I'm not going to worry about them. I am gonna get some of my clutter out of the way so it's not bothering me. My table that I'm working on is super, oh, is my phone actually in here? It's like super messy right now, and it low-key bothers me when I'm <laughs> trying. I'm not just a super, like, um, neat freak by any stretch of the imagination, not even remotely, but when I'm in the middle of doing something and I'm surrounded by my own clutter, I it just, ugh, it's my own fault, but anyway. <laughs> Okay, so I'm going to put down, um, what am I going to put down? I think I'm going to put down the headers once I figure out where they are because I'm blind apparently, which this kit doesn't, okay, it does, okay, sorry. All right, so I'm going to put down the headers.
Okay, um, I'm gonna just do the one header now. Now some of my lines are really off, like this one was off. This one I'm not really sure. <laughs> um, so we'll see as I start putting down some boxes. I'm gonna do this a little out of order than what I have been doing in my personal ones. I'm gonna go ahead and put down these full boxes. I do have to say having that line there at least for the headers, we'll see about the boxes because I'm noticing that some of my lines are, even though I tried um, to line them up, I did this really late last night. <laughs> Sometimes I just put off going to bed and I was like I'm gonna put down these lines and then I got really tired so I was like I'm gonna hurry so that it's done faster. <laughs> um, yes, yeah, so they're not all perfect but I feel like between them and just getting that initial header down straight hopefully we should be somewhat good. I don't think it's gonna be a perfect spread I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I think it's going to be a little difficult, specifically, in my opinion, to do a no white space plan. Um, maybe not. Maybe it would be harder if you weren't butting stickers up together. I don't know, now that I think about that. I'm really rambling here. hundred percent perfect but <laughs> we're gonna roll with it okay so now I'm going to put down the second set of headers Okay, so now I'm going to put down some boxes. Um, here. Oop. Tell you what, those glossy stickers don't play around. Okay, I realized my camera was getting really dark for some reason. I'm not sure what that was about, but I'm hoping that I adjusted it correctly. Fingers crossed. Hopefully I'm able to kind of adjust the beginning of it and uh, you're not stuck with half of a dark, vi dark video. Okay, what am I doing now? Okay, I'm gonna put down, I think there's enough room for Nope, not quite. Ah.
is not that great. Oh well. <laughs> I am not going to spend a lot of time on that. Just as long as... Oh yeah, okay, so that's going to cover... That's not, that's not that bad once you, once you put that down. Um, okay, so let's put down... Um, let's see, let's see, let's see. I'm going to put down another Bildu. Everything's crooked. Oh my gosh. Oh well. Oh well. Oh well. Okay. So. Here's where we're at. So far. Um. It is difficult. It's difficult, especially, I think if I had really taken my time with drawing these pencil lines, um, it probably would be a lot easier. I'm not a perfectionist, and because it's like really stressful <laughs> um, to be one, so I just, I choose not to be, and I should have been. There's some spots that don't line up, but you know, I think with a little practice, you could probably make you, you not probably you could make it work with a little a little more elbow grease than I've <laughs> put into it. Um, so here's the fun part is where exactly I'm going to line my sidebar up. I think I think 
what I'm going to do honestly is line it up with this dotted line over here just to make it simple. Does that look good? No. Oh, no it doesn't. <laughs> Not even a little bit. Okay, let's try that again. Maybe. I always struggle with the sidebar, even in the uh, Erin Condren. Oh, I ripped the... Oh, no, I didn't. Okay. <laughs> I thought I'd pulled the page out of the rings there, or the spiral. <sighs> All right. Let's see how I'm going to do this. I have to do it sideways for some reason. Um, <laughs> I'm just going to try to eyeball centering it here. And then just hope that I put this sticker down straight uh, to butt everything up against it. That's my plan of action. <laughs> okay, that one looks like it went down straight. That looks a little bit... Mm, it looks better than it did. That's We'll go on that. Okay, so I'm going to put that down. I'm going to put down some... Ooh, trackers I do find the rounded boxes make it a little bit more difficult because there's not just a hard corner to match up to another hard corner so it makes it a little bit different okay um let me go ahead and put down this one as well since there are three why not use all three And then there is, oof, checkbox, so yeah, unless you use some white out, you will have to contend with these little strips here, but not too bothersome to me personally. I could continue this washi. Just remember that. <laughs> this is this doesn't have any extra washi. Uh, so instead what I'm going to do is kind of maybe stack some of these little washy, washy finger quotes, air quotes there, finger quotes, air quotes. I'm just going to stack some of this down here at the bottom. Yeah, that, that's okay. It's not perfect, but there could be worse. Nope. Too big. I'm gonna put that one up there. And get one of these little teardrops right here. Oop, I just realized you can't see what I'm doing up there. Do do do. Yeah, we're just gonna leave it at that actually. Okay. Alright, so there's um, let me see if I can get you out. Okay. <laughs> there is a full spread in the Recollections Spiral Planner. It's definitely something you kind of have to work with, I think, to get used to it, especially, I mean, it may not be that big of a deal if you've never had an Erin Condren, if you're used to working with an Erin Condren, it's definitely um, 
it's definitely a bit of a switch, but not at the same <laughs> at the same time. I would say if you want to draw, ugh, gosh, I can talk tonight. I swear. Um, if you want to do the lines, it does help. Do take your time. Um, yeah, overall, I think I'm actually pretty pleased with it. So hopefully we'll do some more in this planner in the future. Thank you for joining me. Bye.